Hello everybody, my name is Kim, welcome we back for another video of Best Month Ever, boys. Mom? We're back for some more of this game, fantastic game. I'm driving, I'm actually driving, holy shit. Mom! Mom! Oh no, she, I'm not driving, she's actually fell asleep on the road, oh, okay. See, I knew this was gonna happen right off the bat, so she fell asleep, of course, well, not fell asleep, but... Mom! Wake Once up. again, boys, Mom. she fell down, and while on the road, I'm telling you, she's a danger to society. Holy! Relax, Mom. I'll take care of them. Okay, so now I'm gonna be playing as the little Mitch. That's Ever not good, though. Right, little guy, what are you doing here? A lie? And sorry, Vasily. I'm just gonna answer it, Vasily. I'm not gonna lie. We've been driving for a long time and just needed to rest. Fine. Just don't stay too long. It's getting dark. Yeah, no problem, uh, mister. There it is. He's not gonna help us, though. He's not gonna check up on us. Kind of a bad cop. I mean, we are in the 60s, I guess, so... Kind of makes sense. The cops How didn't care feeling, at, the ti Mom? at the time. Much better, sweetheart. I'll check the car. And you try to get it started. Well, at least we are on the right side of the law, kind of. We're still at 66% only. Damn, Relations are all the way up, though. Get out of here. Okay, Mitch. Turn it on. Okay, Mom. Okay, so what do we do now? Okay, so we're just trying to start the car up. It's basically all somatic okay, right Mom? now. I'm not doing anything. Yes, don't worry. Mom. Oh, she's falling again. Yeah, she's definitely uh, not doing good. good. <clears throat> definitely not doing good. She's doing horrible, boys. Yeah, here comes another kind of bystander. Decide what to do. Take out the gun. I'm gonna ask for help. I'm not gonna take out the gun. Last time we we asked for help, and they helped us out. So let's do uh, let's do that again. I have faith in everyone, boys. Maybe I'm naive, but that's all, how I am. What happened? It won't start up. Where's your dad? Not around. Will you help us, sir? My auto shop's pretty close. I'll give you all a tow. All right, Thomas. We got lucky, didn't we? We definitely we'll got lucky. This is my son, Mitch. Thomas. Thanks again. You'll thank me later. How long will the repair take? Hard, hard to say. Seems, he seems like a nice dude. Uh, maybe uh, slow on the uh, slow on the talk side, but still a pretty good dude, boys. See, here's the thing. They're probably gonna try and play it like, oh, he's creepy and everything because he's talking weird. That's not true. He's just another human being like everybody else, boys. Just having a hard time uh, talking, that's all. Who is this? His mom? Oh, you brought I them. knew it. It's Welcome. his mother. Their car is broken. I'm going to take care of it now. Good evening. We don't want to bother you. Don't be silly. We love company, but we rarely have guests. Oh, they're What's from the name, South, boys. Dad? We, uh, Luis, we went in the south right here. Son, They've got Mitch. that accent. I'm so glad Thomas has picked you up. My son is a good boy. That's so true. He stopped to help us. Where are you headed? Uh, tell the truth. Lie? I'm never gonna lie. I'm just gonna tell the truth. No matter what happens, I'll tell you the truth. We'll see what happens with that. I'm confident that these people are gonna be good people. Now... They could be like Red Dead Redemption and be uh, weird people, ancestral people that are trying to kill you. But I doubt that's the case, boys. Not everybody's like that in the South. I'm pretty sure. Pretty far to Louisiana. Oh, that's quite a ways. Hard to do without a car. We are in the South after, war, uh, after all. I mean, we're going down Louisiana and everything. Um, what's, uh, what's waiting for you there? Well, I I'm going to tell the truth. I'm going to tell the truth my father hmm and where's your father little boy 
T uh, talk back? I'm just gonna tell the truth. I don't know. We're gonna Very keep telling well. the truth, boys. You come inside. I mean, they do tell me because we're telling the truth for some reason I that brings down our confidence. Cookies. I think that's bullshit. I think telling the truth brings up your confidence, to be honest, because you're not afraid of telling what the other people, uh, what you think. That's just how it is. If you lie, you lack confidence, in my opinion. Lying is the way to, is the bad way to go about it. You should always tell the truth, no matter uh, no matter if it hurts or not, boys. Tell the truth. Then, when people, uh, then when it comes time to actually lie, here comes the, the 100 IQ right there. When it comes time to lie, people uh, lying, people don't make the difference between you telling the truth and lying. Because you tell the truth every time. If you want to lie one time, people are still gonna think you tell the truth. So. Tell the truth all the time, so you have one lie in the bank. You know, that's how it works. You gotta do it that way, boys. Alright, let's go ahead and see what's going on here. She's got, uh... These is this... are my granddaughters. Granddaughters, Hi, okay. What's her name? Where's the mother? Mitch. I am Ada. Ida. Oda. Okay. E uh, idea, Ada, Ida, Ida Oda. They're very original with their name, boys. Poor children. Their mother left when they were little. Oh. For no reason. Kind of sad. Like that. Just like that. One morning, she just packed up and went. I'm raising them with my son now, but he knows cars better than children. He's always been in a world of his own, but he's a good boy. I'm sure he yes, is. You've already said that. I'm not sure how much time our good Lord has left for me, but it won't be forever. The girls need a mother, someone to shelter them from the world and, and push them to do their chores. I'm not sure if I see where you're coming at. If you think I'm going to be that mother, think again, though. Major problem. Can't do I've got enough trouble life. with one kid. Three more power. is going to be a hands a off, a fool's off. All the power lines down. You'll sleep in our guest room. In the morning, I'll see what I can do. We don't want to impose. Oh, stop it, darling. We love guests. Besides, you don't have a choice, do you? I'll lock up the shop now. You never know who's lurking around on a night like this. A night like what? Doc, let's go to your room. I'll show you around. Yeah, I don't know what he meant by that. That's kind of uh, strange and interesting at the same time that he said a night like this. Like, what type of special night are we in right now? Uh, don't bother. Thank you. Uh, I'll show you around. Uh, sure. Thank you, I guess. Thank you. You're very kind. Why are we... See, I don't get it. Why is my confidence going down? Makes no sh this shit make I must be super low on confidence in real life then. What the hell, man? Why is why is uh, being uh, friendly and uh and trustworthy to people low on uh, uh mean Why does being friendly and uh trustworthy in, on people uh, mean that you have low ca uh, confidence or something. That makes no sense. I really don't get it, boys. That just makes no sense to me. Alright, so you scared? I'm gonna tell the truth. Again, boys, always tell the truth. I don't like the dark. If you win, it will get bright. Each of us will hide in a different room. You have to find us one by one, say the name, and light a candle if you get it right. Close your eyes and count to ten. We're playing uh, hide One, and seek. Two, okay, so I guess we're playing some sort of hide three, and seek game, like a uh, not exactly nine, that, but uh, like a different version. Ten. Why well, I know my mother Ready went in that direction. Here I, come. I know they went in that direction. That's kind of cheating, though. The fact that we know where they went. I should have probably closed my eyes myself, so I didn't know where to go. Uh, they went at. There's one of them right there. What the hell? You're not very good at hiding, are you? I see you. Gotcha. 
Not so fast. You still have to say my name. Uh, what? Uh, you're the one that... Ah, oh, shit. I think you're Ida, right? Your name is Ida, right? You forgot my name. Oh, for fuck's sake, you're Ida then. The hallway and count again. Are you what? Bullshit. Nine. Ten. All right. Ready or not, here You better I be come. in the same spot, though, I swear. All right, so she's Ada because Ada is the uh, is the ginger one. So she's got to be... Okay, so that's Ada right there. They're just switching places, really? You're Ada, though. I Found know for you. a fact you're Ada. Yes, but do you remember my name? Yeah, I do. Sure, I remember. You're Ada. There we go. Your name must be Oda. Oh, or Oda. Yes, you remembered. I guess. Whatever you want, you however you pronounce now. it. So the blonde girl is uh, Ada, boys. Imi, ini, mini, minimo. All right. We've got a baseball bat right here. I'm sure he's going to come to uh, and uh, help. It's going to be helpful eventually. Oh, I, wait. I can have her thing, right? She's going to give it, give it to me? Wait. Does she give it to me or not? Let me just go ahead and... Oh, shit. I think I'm stuck. Let's go back, boys. Let's go back around. I think she wants to give me the candle. Can I get it? Can I... I can't get it. All right. Whatever, boys. I don't think I can get it. I don't think... It, I, it might be a prompt or somewhere, but I don't think I can get it. Let's go to this room right here. Let's see really quick. All right. Let's go here. So what do we what do we have here? Oh, I see you. Gotcha. There you go again. <laughs> the fuck is going on with you? You scared? I thought I was the hey, one that was scared. I heard him. Heard who? What? Who? From the cellar. The fuck are you You're talking about? Me on, right? Do I still it's have okay. to say your name? Nothing's happening, all right? Give me your hand and we'll go. We can't come out until you guess our names. Those are the rules. Otherwise, we'll be punished. Punished? The hey, fuck are you doing? It's just a game. But, okay? Okay, well, you're Ada. Your name is Ada. Good. Whatever is going on with you, you're acting pretty weird, my girl. I don't know what type of uh, strange stuff is happening in this house, but I'm starting to get worried here. Oh, what, what's going on with him? Keep your mouth shut. You don't want me to punish you, do you? Wait, he's not stuttering anymore? I'm starting to be worried here. This man is not even stuttering anymore. Is she in here? Okay, let me just see real quick. What's that room? There's a lot of guests' room right here. Oh, she's uh, right here. Okay, what's going on here? There you are. You found me, but now you have to say my name. Yeah, of course. Okay, sure. Your, Your name, name is, is Ida. Because I've already named the other one, so. Ida. Your name is Or Haida. Yes. You can light my candle now. Will they stop playing games and it. hopping off and uh, we'll in, man? Tomorrow I'm oh, damn it, my friends, boys. You never know. It's, they, they can't do he that. Lives behind this door. I'm on video right now. Nobody. I saw your dad coming out from behind this door and talking to somebody. Should we tell him? A ghost lives in the cellar. Right. A ghost? Are you sure it's a not ghost. a monster? I knew we wouldn't believe. Nobody's allowed in there. Your dad was there. Dad is allowed, but Ghost tells him to bring things. Sure, what? In return, what he does he tell him exactly? But sometimes, at night, you can hear terrible sounds in the cellar. My guess is something's not really a Did ghost. I don't know what's kids? in there. It's not a human being, boys. They're uh, they're trying to make us think that it's probably you somebody know, kidnapped or something. It's I probably not. It's probably just a cat. A cat or a dog don't is you, trying to honey? help out or something. I'm telling you. Uh, I feel, don't you, honey? Uh, I'm going to confirm. Uh, I'm going to insert evasely. I'm not going to want to confirm too much. Just insert evasely. You're a very kind, ma'am. You 
remind me of someone, but you're much prettier. Isn't she pretty, Thomas? Who's that? Somebody else? Hi, Tom. The George. Guess. Max Hunter's farm, 11 o'clock. We've got a job to do. I'll be there. One more thing. Would you happen to have seen a blue Cadillac around? They say it was parked by the road earlier. Who are these people? No, Why are they asking about us? Didn't see it. Yeah, he's protecting okay. us, all right. See you later. We're gonna have some fun. Darling, if you were single, my Tom would have been a perfect match for you, right? I'm not Mom, too sure about that. Can you please shut up? By the way, why aren't you wearing your wedding ring? I answer evasively. I'm gonna answer evasively, like always, boys. This turkey is very good. You want Did to check the cellar, my guy? Is that the ghost? A ghost? Well, you're too old for ghost stories. I heard you have to bring him all kinds of stuff. Yeah, traps for the damned rats. And once, a rattlesnake bit our dog. What happened to him? He died. Damn, that's the rough. The rattlesnake or the dog? The dog died. The snake went away, Mitch. And you, snotty girls, I'm going to punish you for scaring our guests. They didn't do anything. Uh, scold Mitch, change the subject. I'm not going to scold Mitch for that. I mean, he's just being truthful, boys. He's, to, he's learning it from me. It is just how it is, so... Uh, I'm just going to change the subject. Uh, how do Trying you to be friendly turkey? with them. I'll teach you, honey. It's a family recipe. Uh, thank you for this lovely As long dinner. as it's not made of humid You're meat, welcome. we're going to be fine. We love having guests. We're going to bed. I can barely stand up. Mom is ill. Ill with what, honey? Uh, nothing serious. Just a cold. Yeah, just a cold. Big cap on that Breakfast one, boys. Seven. Hey, thanks again for everything. Good night. And they eat at 7 o'clock? Good lord. I mean, it could be earlier than that, I guess, Mom, I suppose. This place is kind it's still of pretty early for me, man. What's on your mind? When he was walking out of the cellar, I heard Mr. Thomas threaten someone with punishment if they don't keep quiet. And later, the sisters told me about a ghost who lives there. And then at dinner, we heard noises under the floor. Something evil is happening here, Mom. I don't think it's anything evil, to Maybe be honest. It could be things. just hearsay. I think, I think it's just hearsay, my guy. Quite right. I think there's nothing happening there. It's totally a normal house. No kidnapping here whatsoever. I think what's happening here is just a cat or a dog. They are another dog they have. They're just not telling us. They're trying to... They have some sort of animal or whatever they, they're trying to take care of. I'm, I'm pretty sure, boys. That's gotta be what happens. Let me just open this really quick. What's going on here? Quiet in there. See, I'm telling you, they're not telling us. It's not telling us the whole story right here. And I would think that I gotta check this there's out. more to this. To sleep. I'm coming with you. Man, that's a bad idea. No, Mitch. Stay here and don't come out, no matter what. What if Lock I fall door. down, though? What? When I knock three times... Who's gonna wake me up? Head. Mom, I'm afraid of this ghost. I don't want to be alone. Ghosts don't exist? One has to be tough. You know what? One has to be tough. Or one has to be dough. Is that dough or tough? I'm not sure, boys. English. Not my forte. Well... Pretty good at it, but uh, Sweetheart, some words. You can't spend the whole night trembling under the covers. The world shouldn't change you. You have to change the world. Got it? There it is. Got That's it. a good quote right there. You're a smart boy. The cellar door is locked. I'll look for the key. All right, let's look for the key. I guess there's got. How convenient that would be a key for the cellar, right where we are. I'm pretty sure it's not the case. Where? Why do we have a gun? 
Oh my god, we have a gun, boys. What, do we plan on shooting somebody? What the hell is this? We're guests. Why are we... Now we're just creating trouble into a guest, a guest house. They're being friendly to us. Giving us turkey and everything, boys. And we're just planning on killing them. Why? Some old suitcase, but no keys here. What could be in that suitcase, though? I wonder. A human head. At this point, that I, I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, let me use this. A ring, Just a knife. Guns, knives and forks, quite dirty. We should be making a lot of noise right now. I'm surprised that we're not. Why aren't we just taking the baseball bat? To be honest, I think it would be a lot better than just taking uh, the uh, the gun. You know, we don't want to scare off. A, a gun makes a lot of noise. We got some keys. Oh, this must be the keys. See, I don't like this. This is trespassing at this point. They were, they were being, uh, these get, these people were being really friendly to us. They were helping us out and all of a sudden, I'm going to check on that door. Is there anybody here? No? Okay. Let's just see really quick, boys. Let's open the door. Uh, if anything happens, I'm just going to say that, uh, I'm a sleepwalker, I guess. What the fuck just happened? You're about to join him, you nosy cunt. What the? Well, he's not a ghost, he's a Cuckoo Clan member. That's not the same thing. I'm guessing he's just a, 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 a dumbass Cuckoo Clan member as well. Holy, we were ready for him. Take that, motherfucker. Well, I guess I was wrong, boys. I guess he's a bad dude after all. Mitch, go find a piece of I know we're in with. the south, but come on, man. I felt better of these people. All right, let's find out really quick. There's gotta be people. Find the rope. What rope? The fuck are you talking about? There's a rope in here. Oh shit! See, they've still been friendly to us, but now they knock my mother off. I don't. I don't take kindly to that. That's not a very f uh, kind thing to do to guests. All right, let's uh, let's tie him up really quick. Unless he's playing dress up, which uh, convincingly, uh, convincingly enough looks a there? lot like a Cuckoo's Clan member, boys. It's a bad dress up. Uh, are we going in there? Forbid Mitch to exist? Oh, I, for, I read to exist. I was like, what the hell? All right, explain you don't want to put him in danger anymore. I don't want to play. Uh, yeah. You know what? I'm just not going to want to put him in danger. No, you know? Mitch, I want to be going. careful. You go back to the room, and this time you stay there. I haven't learned anything. Apparently, you learned things that scare me. And I taught you all that. What's wrong with that? Mitch, please. Okay, See, here's Mom, the thing, Mitch. Maybe you helped me. Maybe you would have been better off not helping me out. I don't know. Alright. I might have woken up at some point. I didn't really need your help too much. I did use this. Time to go. Did we really tie him up? I mean, we tie up his boots. We didn't tie up... Like, uh, we didn't tie up his hands. He's just gonna wake up and untie himself. What the hell is this? We're the worst... We're, we're literally the worst at this. Alright, so we already know what's down there at this point. I thought at the beginning it was cats or dogs, but I guess like, it's not the case anymore. Um, like I said, unless he's playing dress up, a bad dress up, but I I doubt that. So, yeah, I knew it. I knew they were Cookies Clan members, boys. Doesn't surprise me at all. There you are, you bastard. And they're taking pictures of their own faces. I don't know this dude, but to complete a perfect it's kind of stupid to do that. Dear Granny. Hello. Who are you? Let me find out. Who are you? Oh my god. What's going on? What do you think is going on? You don't know about the cookie clan, my girl? Careful. He's coming back. He must run away. When he finds out. Easy. He won't hurt you now. Let us go. Please. Open. Open the doors really quick. Wait. How is she brunette? 
She looks as as white ash as me, man. Hold on. She's not brooded. They're not brooded at all. She's even blonde. What the hell is this? I'm kind of confused on the motives of uh, of the guy now. Uh, I don't know. A few years. And those little girls? They are our daughters. Oh we shit. We hear them playing above our heads. That's kind of fucked it's up. Her father. He kidnapped me when I was jogging by the highway. He entered our home, hit my dad with a hammer. Is is my dad alive? I doubt that. I had a date with him at a bar and woke up in this cage. Why didn't anybody try to find us? <clears throat> uh, now oh. comes my time. Of course. What's How convenient, you? boys. I'm okay now. Let's go upstairs. He'll well, kill it's us. a 4v3, uh, no, 4v1. He won't be up Surely we were going to be able to handle them. What do we do with him? Justice, the police. You know damn well the cops aren't going to do shit. They're in on it for all we know. They're probably part of uh, of the clan as well. But you know we got to we got to make right. We got to call the police. You know what it is. It doesn't matter, you won't be arrested, but we gotta do the right thing, boys. Justice won't give us anything. I think we just gotta go go the, the right way, the right way on the law. See what happens. Whatever happens, happens. They're not gonna arrest him, I already know, but... Don't untie him no matter what. Call the police. They are his buddies. I don't give a fuck if they're Even their buddies. buddies. Ignore it. But if you're scared, it is what it is. Call your local newspaper. You bitch! What just happened? Holy! That old woman is was no crazy. Hey, just put the the gun on to the guy's hands, and then tell the cops Still that he alive. shot his mother. He went all crazy. We'll now care. they don't have a choice but to arrest him. I'll be going now. Unless they gotta really want to do a big cover up or something. Well, all right, that went south real Maybe quick. What about the other girls? The I'll tell you on the road. Ah, nobody interesting. Just a bunch of random girls who got kidnapped in uh, our word. Once again, boys, they like what that. Do you need, Mr. The game, the developers, they really put in uh, now we'll play the a lot of uh, Should we make things right story on here? that part. Okay, so should we make things right before Louisiana? Yes. Or no, we just go straight to Louisiana. What does I mean, make things right? You mean going straight to the cops or something and trying to help out that whole thing? You know, that's not our problem. We got bigger problems, bigger fish to fry, boys. I'm sorry, but we got to go to Louisiana. We got a destination here. I don't even know how much time I've got left, to be honest. So let's just go to Louisiana. Wow. Let's go see Grandpa. I'm proud of you, you know? I think so. But I just can't let this slide. Because you just don't care? No, Mitch. Because I still do care. So, are we going to Louisiana or not? Because I guess I was playing as Mitch in that situation. Mom was awesome. I see that now. But on the other hand, I'd have to think twice before putting my child in danger. Bitch, you're the one. Okay, you know what? We tried to tell you. Now, what is this exactly? What's going on here? So, we are not going to Louisiana. I guess she made the decision for this us because I decided as Mitch I wanted to go back to Louisiana, but I guess that she fought otherwise. I swear. I don't believe you. Yeah, nothing. I don't believe you either. What the hell, man? Louise, we should have went to Louisiana. This is not our problem. This is obviously not our problem. We shouldn't have gotten involved with this. Uh, the last thing I need for my video as well is to get this going on. Finally, Thomas. Do you I look like Thomas? Time. I'm I'm skinny as fuck. Put How that do gun I? Down, Thomas. They're or really dumb. Shoot that before we hang. On your knees! Thomas is gone. Get down on your knees in two seconds or you'll meet his fate. Ah! 
You're dead, oh. bitch. Now your turn. There goes a brave one. He might be alive. Want to help him? Take your hood off. You know him? Yeah, he's our sheriff. Well, well, what oh, do you know? I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. I saw his pictures. Cuff him. You're making a big mistake. I'm not making you any made a mistake, mistake, my girl. Took off your hood for all those lynching party photos. Can I shoot him? You saw my face. Take his gun away. I've got your pictures and others have them too. Death penalty in each of them. Uh, offer a deal with, that would facilitate further travels. Offer the prisoner to take the law into his own hands. You know what? Let's make a deal. I let you go off with that whole thing that you're doing weird shit. And you let me alone. You tell your buddies all across uh, the, the, the country to leave me alone for eternity. How does that sound? How does that sound, huh? Let's make a deal right here. We've established who you are. But do you know who I am? No. To make it easy on you, I'll say that I was the one in the blue Cadillac. So you are wanted. Kind of. This is how I see it. If I do time, you'll get the electric chair. I've got your pictures with all those people you killed. So if the cops pull me over, I'll take them out. Okay. I know what you're thinking. If you kill us quickly, nobody sees the photos. But I've already sent them to a safe place. If a single person of a different color disappears in or around the town of Hope, the papers get your photos. And you know what? If my son weren't looking now, I'd kill you. Just like that. I could still do it. I mean, there's nothing Why stopping me, to be honest. Man, man? We already killed a man in, in front of him. What are you After talking about, Luis? This man is dead for sure. Black morass? Yeah. Have you been there? No, I'm afraid not. But I have a good friend who lives there on an alligator farm. All right. Was his name Leon? Good Lord, Leon, of course. So, Louise? Leon spoke of you many times. Did he now? Your mother said the same thing. I met her in Hope. How unsearchable are his judgments and how fathomless his ways. Your father had so much to tell you. He, he was grief-stricken that he ran out of time. What do you mean, he ran out of time? Find him and ask for yourself. I'll do that. I leave the sheriff in your charge, but don't do anything well? silly. He's going to promise you. It wouldn't happen to, uh, to have the same sickness as me. Thanks, Louise. Or maybe he knows about my sickness or something. Later, we read in the paper that a killer <laughs> kidnapped the sheriff. But the sheriff broke loose and killed him. But they didn't follow us. Did you get him, Mom? I'm not sure. I could have helped you with the Winchester. Once you shoot a person, you'll want to do it again. So what? So you'll kill an innocent person. Yeah, and never exactly. Forget it. So or you become a fucking you. maniac and just kill, start killing people for no shoot? reason. So nobody kills you. Are we going to see Grandpa? Yes. Is Grandpa cool? He used to be very cool, but then he left his kids without a word. And my dad left us without a word too? No. Can you be quiet for a while, Mitch? I think he did. Alright. Not sure what happened to our dad. Uh, to his dad, but he could have been an asshole to leave us like that. I don't know what happened. Maybe he got killed. Maybe I'm wrong, but... Uh, you know for the next few hours so uh, we we're gonna silence. go ahead and well I, i'm gonna Suddenly, wait for the my mother looked the cutscene really quick to handle the most important thing in life are your principles all right so we're gonna end it right here boys remember to leave a like and subscribe and enjoy the video i'll see you guys for the next one keep it easy